Hello, here's another AQA A-level physics question, and this one's on nuclear physics. If you want to try to answer this question yourself, pause the video now. If you've got the answer D, well done. Okay, so the diagram shows an area of 0.1 meters squared, lying normal to a line, connecting it to a point source of gamma radiation. The source emits photons uniformly in all directions, so we've got photons coming off in every single direction, and the area and the source are separated by a distance of 2 metres. The source emits 5,000 gamma photons per second. How many photons pass through the area, there's the area, every second? Well, we can think of that area as lying on a sphere that has a radius of 0.2 meters from that source. Now all 5,000 of the photons are going to go through that sphere, but the number that will go through that area is the fraction of that area of the total sphere. So if I work out the area of the sphere uh, and then divide this area by the area of the sphere multiplied by 5,000, I'm going to find the number that go through that area. So let's do that together now. So the area of a sphere, again, this is all on your data book, data uh, sheet is 4 pi r squared. So the area of that sphere is 4 multiplied by pi. The radius is 2 meters, 2 squared. So the area is 16 pi meters squared. Now, the number of photons that pass through this area is going to be that area of 0.1 meters over the total area of the sphere multiplied by the total number of photons that are being emitted each second. And if I put that into my calculator, I will get an answer of 10 photons per second just going through that area. The answer is D. If that was useful, hit the subscribe button there please, like, share, hit the notification bell and keep watching more in the series. Thank you.